What's up guys, Universal Mastery. Wherever you're at, Universal Mastery. I'm following you today, Universal Mastery. Follow me there. And Once again, Universal Mastery, thanks for watching. I'm about the energy that you hold right now creates your future. I was never the person that could settle for that shit. Everything should be a learning experience. You should always be, we're supposed to evolve. So you need to learn these tools, you need to learn these skills to grow, become strong. What's up my brothers and sisters, Universal Mastery coming to you on a beautiful day, Miami Beach. Um, so yeah, so basically what I want to talk about in this video is I want to give you guys a little bit of um, a tool. This is going to be a tool, this is going to be a tip. And this, what this is basically going to do is this is going to give you a, a way to produce energy. Okay, so it's going to give you a way to not only produce energy, but sustain a, a certain type of energy, which is then, which is then going to create, if you will, a new energy body for yourself. So, so think of it like this. So you're going to be able to, through this tool I'm about to give you, and, and, and this tool is like within your own body. Like you can do this. You don't need any out, like you don't need anything. All you need is your hands, okay? And there's other ways to do it if you don't have hands, okay? But this 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 tool that I'm about to give you is powerful. And the way the way you want to think of it is you're creating this energy, right? You're creating this energy body. So basically, the people that this would definitely benefit for are people that are not that feel like their subconscious and their conscious isn't aligned properly. So if you feel like your subconscious is not properly aligned with your conscious and you just can't make things that you want happen and you just feel really frustrated about it, it's just really hard for you to, to make that happen, um, then this is definitely gonna be more geared towards you. But in general, this tool can also be used for people that have clear consciousness um, on both spectrums, subconscious and, and prefrontal cortex. But um, it'll just be a good tool so that way you know, in life, we always come. We always will come across toxic people. There will always be those people. There will always be toxic people. People that try and tell you you can't do things. People that literally have the worst energy and do nothing but spread it on to other people. So, in case you come across uh, someone like that, uh, hopefully you won't. But the truth is, you will. Um, in case you come across someone like that, you can also use this tool if you feel like your energy has dropped. So, basically, what I'm saying is, have you ever experienced? Sometimes you feel really good and you feel like everything's aligned, everything's going right, you're attracting the right things in your life because remember, as within, so without. And uh, then, then you like hang out with, with the wrong crowd or you, you get around the wrong person for, for, for a period of time and then you, you feel like everything just is like out of line. And you're like, damn, like I worked so hard to get it in line and I worked so hard for everything to work out but then it just, you know, it just doesn't work out anymore. And then you might be thinking like, well, how, why is it like that? And then. You know, hopefully you, you would intuitively know like to stay away from that person. That's the first thing you want to do. You want to be aware of it and then be like, okay, now I got to get away from that person. But it can be it can be a bitch when you when you can't when you can't learn how to get your um, your energy back when you can't learn how to get your things back in line, especially at a fast pace. Because I know for me, like I would definitely want to be able to get it as fast paced as possible. I'd be like, I want to I want to get my, my shit rolling again. I don't I don't want that person to affect me for like a week or two weeks. And then I finally get back in the groove of things. And then somebody else comes. That's just not a good way to live. So you want to be in full control of your life and you want to realize the power that you have. So that's basically the, the little key. That's 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 the that's the the run through of, of why I'm going to give you this tool and why why and how you could use this tool. OK, so the tool and it, this is this is gonna this is gonna this might seem to you this might seem a little a little either weird it's gonna seem weird it's gonna seem um, unbelievable and it's gonna seem like strange it's gonna seem like how do you, like how does that even make sense so if if you you know that, that definitely that's that's a normal thought to have with it but you also have to open your mind you have to say you know maybe there's a chance that this works and if you just label it as weird. Um, and you don't believe it, and you just label it like that, then you're weak-minded because there is scientific evidence behind this is a spiritual practice as well because you're building your energy body. So right now, there's literally an energy body around me. You just can't see it. Maybe you can see it. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna say you can't, but most likely you can't see it right now. Um, it takes a lot of meditation to be able to see those things. Um, but there is an energy body around me, and this tool is to build that energy body. It's to rebuild that, and then once you can align it, once you get your energy body back up to its height, to, to where it needs to be, um, then you don't need to use the tool anymore. And then you can just let it, and then your your con your subconscious is now aligned with your conscious mind, and things move a lot more smoothly. So, so this is the tool. So, 
when you come in when you come in contact with somebody that has really negative energy and and then you feel out of whack this is a tool and this is this is going to channel your subtle energy okay once again this is going to channel your subtle energy so when you're feeling out of whack and you're like oh shit like you just don't know how to react anymore because you've been around that toxic person do this take your hand right because there's there's certain nerves in the hand okay and these these nerves are in are in complete correlation with with your energy with your energy body absolutely and and it's a very powerful tool so take your hand and then take your fingers and do that but do it like that do it at whatever pace is fast you know fast enough for you do it as as fast as, as a pace as possible whatever you need but you'll know as soon as you start doing it so look see my fingers right there see my fingers right there so you'll know that you're, you're, you'll, you'll feel this, you'll feel it, it'll really be a weird shift. Like, so I re definitely recommend you try this because it really works and you'll know, you'll know when you try it. Um, you'll, you'll feel energy, like you'll almost feel like a connectedness, like your subtle energy is in your hand now. So like when I'm doing that right now, my subtle energy is in my hand. So I'm channeling energy through my hand, through my fingers, and I can feel my subtle energy. So I, I can feel my reactiveness, I can feel my awareness expand just by doing that. Now obviously, you only need to do this for for pretty much until until you know it's time to stop and you'll know you'll you'll feel like okay I'm gonna like go of it now and your, your hands will get really tired and all that stuff but when you you know when you get to that point where you're you know you're you're about to let it go then your your subconscious is now realigned with your conscious so things move a lot more smooth and you're back to where you were and you just used a tool it's almost like working out it's like literally like the same concept as working out when it's like mind body and spirit literally it's the same thing um, but no one's teaching this stuff. No one's really teaching this stuff. I have one mentor online. I, he's not he's not necessarily my mentor Like I don't speak with him personally or anything But I consider him a mentor because I really take his his advice and I learn from him and he's teaching the same thing right now And it, I thought that was so cool because I, I I was taught this from intuitive like I I learned this intuitively and I've you know I've been around a lot of toxic people and I would notice how my energy shifted and all that stuff and then I started doing this and at first I was like I'm fucking weird like I thought it was weird and I thought you know just kind of kind of kind of labeled it labeled it bad at first kind of labeled it like why am I doing that maybe I shouldn't do that maybe it's not not helping me and then and then I kind of I kind of understood it and and part of the reason why I labeled it that was because one of the toxic people that I'm talking about noticed that I did it and they called me out on it and they're like why like they're like why are you moving your fingers like that and, and no one else call, ever called me out on that except for the one person that that got me to the point where I needed to do that the one person that was trying, that was making my life harder, was the one person that called it out. Almost like, you know, like, have you ever noticed when you're when you're about to do something really big and some good, and and then those um, those then the toxic people come out and they try and stop your growth out of nowhere. They just come out of the fucking wood woodworks. They just like come out of the fucking blue and they just try and stop your progress and they try and put you down. It was like the same concept. Like I I, I learned this and then the person called me out. They're like, they're like, why are you moving your fingers like that? And I was like. In my head, I knew I was like, because I can feel how my energy is being channeled right now, and I'm creating this new energy body for myself because you're toxic ass. But I didn't say that to the person, right? I didn't say that to the person because the the bigger lesson behind it is I need to just get away from that person and then do my tool on the side. But they labeled it and they said they said I wouldn't do that. They they the person told me like I wouldn't do that with your fingers, and I asked why, and they didn't even have a good reason why. Just simply the fact that they wanted to stop stop me from growing and stop me from progressing and evolving and all that stuff. That's what a hater is. And then, um, yeah. So so I labeled it from that day. I remember I, I was like, you know what? I don't. I'm not gonna do that shit anymore because that person realized it, and I don't want like I don't want people to think I'm weird. I don't want people to think like I don't know. And then slowly and surely, um, I got away from that person. Then new flood of consciousness came to me. And it said, no, you're not fucking weird. It's scientifically proven. That's always a tool that you have in your toolbox now. You can always use that if you want. Always use that. It's always to your use. And this was like, not, not some person told me this, but like a higher consciousness, like a higher power, if you will. So I, I ran with that and I was like, you know what? Yeah, that person that, person that, that labeled it, uh, why am I doing it? Like, fuck them. I don't, I don't care what they think. You should never, that, that's another tip of advice. You should never care what your haters think, ever. Don't ever care what they think. Just let them hate because their hate will empower you. Let them hate from a distance. Their hate will empower you. Um, so yeah, so then I started, I just, you know, I, 
I didn't pick it up again, but the fl new flood of consciousness was was contemplating like, you know, it is, it, it works, it works, it works, but I, I just never did it again. I was like, you know, I don't know if I should do it. And then I happened to come across a video on YouTube of that mentor I was telling you about, and he scientifically explained the whole thing too, and he, he knows the whole thing. He completely is teaching the same thing, just in a different way he's teaching it. But um, I have my own unique way, and I think my way works wonders. And then his way probably works wonders for other people too. Um, so yeah, so it's scientifically proven. I have to always remind myself that. Like that's, it's, it's not easy being, you know, a young philosopher out here because people are always trying to label you and they're always trying to say you're crazy, but th these things are science, man. This, this stuff is truth. I don't say anything that I don't, that I don't know works. I will never tell you guys. That's my promise to you guys. I will never tell you anything that I have not sure knowledge that it works. I promise that. Everything that I tell you guys is stuff that I've done and I've seen results from it. And I, and literally my purpose is to help you guys move in the direction that you know you need to move in. Move into a, a better position, move into, you know, just abundance in life, true joy, all that stuff. So yeah, so once again, channel it, channel it, channel it, channel it. And then, um, yeah, so that's pretty much gonna wrap up the video. We're already at 11 minutes right now. And I hope you guys have a great rest of the day or night wherever you're at. Make sure that you follow my Instagram, J-E-R underscore 477. Once again, Jer underscore 477. Hope you guys have a great rest of the day or night once again and peace.